Welcome to Code Jungle. In this video, we will learn about breadth first search. Breadth first search or BFS is a traversing algorithm which is used for traversing through graphs and trees. Here, the traversing is done starting from the root or the source node and then the traverse continues in the graph or the tree level wise. In this video, we will discuss about breadth first search for a graph. However, we also have a video for breadth first search for trees and the link for the same has been given below in the description box. So, to begin with, we will consider this graph. Here, the root node is node 1. So, we will push it into the queue. The next step is to consider the first element of the queue and push all the neighbor elements of this particular node into the queue. Here, the first element is 1 and its neighbor nodes are 2 and 3. Hence, they are pushed into the queue. So, here we can see 2 and 3 into the queue. At the same time, the element 1 will be popped out of the queue and will be kept for displaying in the output. Here, we will add one extra point that is we will mark the element which has already been considered for displaying in output as visited. Hence, it has been marked in green. Now, the next element in queue is 2. So, again we will see what all are the neighbor elements for 2. Here, the neighbor elements for 2 are 3, 4 and 5. Hence, 4, 5 and 3 are inserted into this queue. Also, 2 has been marked as green because 2 has been moved to the output. Now, the next element into the queue is 3. Again, we will see what all are the neighbor elements for 3. Here, the neighbor element for 3 are 6 and 7. Hence, 6 and 7 are pushed into the queue. And 3 has been moved into the output. Next, the next element in queue is 4. Hence, we will see what all are the neighbor elements for 4. Here, there are no neighbor elements for 4. Hence, no element has been pushed into the queue. Going forward, we will see what all are the neighbor elements for 5. But before that, do note that 4 has been moved to the output. Now, coming to the element 5, Element 5 has a neighbor node as element 4. However, as element 4 has already been visited, hence it will not be pushed into the queue. However, 5 will be popped out of the queue to move to the output. Next, coming to the next element that is 3. As 3 is already visited, hence it will be popped out of the queue. However, will not be included into the output. Next, we will consider element 6 which is the next element into the queue. Here 6 has a neighbor element as 7. Hence 7 is moved into the queue and 6 has been moved to the output. Now coming to element 7. Element 7 has no neighbor nodes. Hence nothing has been pushed into the queue. However 7 has been popped out to move to the output. Now again Coming to the next element that is 7. Here as 7 is already visited, hence it will not be moved to the output. However, it will be popped out from the queue. Next, there is no more elements in the queue. Hence, the queue is empty. So, the algorithm stops over here. And this is the output which we got. And this is how we execute BFS algorithm on a graph. That's all for this video. Link for the source code for this algorithm is given below in the description box. If you like the video, don't forget to hit the like button and do comment, share and subscribe to the channel. We will be back soon with more videos. Thanks for watching.